He's comfortable both in front and behind the camera. You've seen him act in major South African television productions such as Issy Dingo, Jacob's Cross, Cha Cha and Josie H to name but a few. But when the camera stops rolling, will he be able to act his way out of this one? This week, Kromla Dandala will be standing in for Reedy Klavi. We're about to unveil the brand new Friday stand-in for Talk Radio 702 and 567 Cape Talk this Friday. Very excited to welcome uh, Kromala Dandala to the studios outside the 702 building. Is this the very first time you've done radio? This is the first time I've ever done radio. And you're choosing the Friday stand-in to make that your debut? Technically, I'm not choosing. I was trying to get the 2, 2 a.m. slot, but right. that didn't work out. Have you taken a look at the breakdown of the show? Are there certain areas or certain segments you're either really looking forward to or certain segments that you are petrified of? Uh, I am petrified of the open line uh, because you never know what what people will come up with and I assume one one has to be fairly clued up about a lot of a lot of stuff. I am looking forward to the tech and the science stuff. I, I'm a geek. Are you a coffee or a tea man? Because if you're a coffee man, most radio people are because we don't function in a sane manner without coffee. Are you a coffee man? Would you believe I don't drink both tea or coffee? Really? Yeah. I am a nerd. I really am a nerd. Right. Tell us a little bit more about that. Is that is it is it the gaming side, the tech side, the like where where does that come from? I mean, most guys, most boys enjoy their their little toys Comic at home. Books. I grew up. Oh, yeah, I, book, yeah. My dad. Star Trek. That's cool, man. Totally. There totally. We go. Brilliant. Um, nice. My dad wouldn't buy me toys, and so every time I asked for a toy, he would buy me a comic. His logic that's was... That's a cool was, dad. Jeez. That's a very uh, cool dad. No, Comic books from a dad? sucked at the <laughs> time. <laughs> sucked. I wanted one of those uh, He-Man toys. I, I, you never I, got any of those? No, never did. Do you spoil yourself now with a lot of things that are perhaps meant to be for kids? I have everything. <laughs> everything. I have the entire DC line, the entire image, Marvel. I, I have everything. I reenact the entire... Um, uh, Avengers movie. Oh nice, yeah. good on you, good on you. Chick Magnet, I like that. <laughs> the greatest piece of advice you've ever been given? I've had a couple of them, but um, the one that stands out was my dad's eldest brother, my uncle, who said to me, listen, always look for one star and the heavens will be revealed to you. That's very nice actually. Essentially he was saying, excel at one thing. Find the one thing that completes you do that and you will find that everything else will come to be. So really all I know is acting. I'm, I'm, I know how to take a script and turn it into a play, a TV series, a movie. That's what I know. And look, I'm doing radio. Uh, best luck to you come Friday. I think Thank it's going to be absolutely much. fantastic. The Thank next edition much. of the Friday Standard. And we wish you the best of luck and hope the show goes well. Thank you so much.